Now we will discuss what is graphics context. Graphic context enables you to draw graphics on your screen. We will use graphics objects to control the drawing. Graphics objects contain the methods that can be used for drawing, font manipulations and color manipulations. Java applets use a graphics object G as an argument to manage applet graphics context. Java provides platform independent capabilities. This is because graphics are drawn differently on different platforms like Windows and Unix. When Java is implemented on each platform, a derived class of graphics is created that actually implements all the drawing. The graphics method used to draw graphics are paint, repaint and update. Paint method is defined in component class of Java. This is available in java.awt package. General form of paint method is paint method followed by void as written type, paint method name and graphic class object as an argument. You have to override paint method because it does nothing by default. The paint method automatically starts when a component is displayed. If you need to call paint method, then you have to use repaint. Repaint method requests a call to update method of component class. This method clears the background of component. Update method then again calls the paint method directly. Repaint should not be overridden because it performs some system dependent tasks. Update method takes a graphics object as an argument. It is automatically provided by the system when update is called. Now we will see what is color control in Java. Java defines color class that contains methods and color constants. This figure shows some methods and color constants. The constants are created by using red, green and a blue component. Now we will see font control provided by Java. Java provides a font class that can be used to write text in different fonts. Font class methods and constants control the display of text. Some constants like plain, bold, italic and the methods like getName and getFamily are defined in font class. This picture displays different fonts using font control of Java. You can draw graphics by using object of graphics 2D class. Graphics 2D is a subclass of graphics class. To gain access to the graphics 2D capabilities, you must downcast the graphics reference pass to paint method. Java 2D API provides most advanced features of two-dimensional graphics capabilities. It includes features for processing line, art, text and images. The packages include in Java 2D API are java.awt.images. java.awt.color and java.awt.image.renderable. Java 2D shapes include packages that allow you to create 2D shapes like thick lines, filling shapes with patterns and drawing dashed lines. You can use java.awt.geom. Java package includes double precision ellipse 2D, rectangle 2D, round rectangle 2D and line 2D. This figure shows some of the 2D shapes. It has a thick line, a dotted line and a shapes with pattern. Graphical user interface consists of labels, text fields, buttons, checkboxes, combo boxes. Graphical user interface consists of labels, text fields, buttons, checkboxes, combo boxes, lists and panels. Java.swing package allows you to create these components. 
Swing components are completely written in Java and these are considered lightweight components. Swing package defines classes to create these components. JLabel component is component of graphics user interface. Java defines JLabel class that is used to create text labels that are placed on a graphics object. This screenshot shows the output generated by using JLabel class. Now we will discuss about event handling model of Java. Graphical user interfaces are event driven that is they generate events when the user of the program interacts with the GUI. Some common interactions are moving the mouse, clicking the mouse, clicking a button, typing in a text field and closing a window. To process a graphical user interface event, the programmer must perform two key tasks that is register the event and implement an event handler. An event listener for a GUI event is an object of a class that implements event listener interfaces from the package java.awt.event and package java.x.swing.event. Java defines classes and interfaces for handling events. These are shown in this picture. java.lang.object class is at the top of the hierarchy and its subclasses are event object and awt.awt event. This class has further different types of event classes. The component event class has some subclasses and one of these classes is an input event class that has key event and mouse event classes. These handle keyboard and mouse events. Event listener interfaces helps to identify the event that has occurred it. It has action listener, key listener and a mouse listener capabilities. This output shows two screenshots when you press the button on first screen it will generate an event and the handler will print the message. Java defines J button class to create buttons. This figure shows different types of buttons that are created by using J button class. Java defines J text class to create different types of text fields. This figure shows different types of text fields created by using J text class. The general form to create text fields is also given here. Java also provides J radio button class to create radio buttons. This figure shows radio button example that are created by using J radio button class. You can create checkboxes by using built in Java class J checkbox. This figure shows sample checkboxes created by using J checkbox class. The Java allows you to create lists and perform operations on that list. Java has defined J list class to create lists. This picture shows a list that is created using J list class. Java allows you to create multiple selection lists and perform operations on that list. For example, copy it into some other area. Java has defined J list class to create multiple selection lists. This picture shows a multiple selection list that is created using J list class. Now we will see some mouse event handling methods defined in mouse listener and mouse listener interface. The general form of these methods is given here. The mouse event handling methods include mouse pressed, mouse clicked, mouse released and mouse exited. Mouse pressed is called when mouse button is pressed on a graphic component. Mouse clicked is called when mouse is pressed and released without moving the mouse cursor. 
Java provides key listener, event listener interface for handling key events. Key events are generated when keys on the keyboard are pressed and released. The class that implements key listener must provide definitions for methods, key pressed, key released, and key typed. Now we will discuss how Layout Manager helps you to arrange graphical user components on a container for presentation purposes. There are three layout managers in Java. These are Flow Layout, Border Layout, and Grid Layout. Flow Layout is the default layout for java.ewt.applet. java.ewt.panel and javax.swing.jpanel. It places components sequentially from left to right in the order they are added. It is also possible to specify the order of the components using container add method that takes a component and integer position as argument. Border layout is default for the content panes of JFrame and other windows and J applet. It arranges the components into five areas, north, south, east, west, and center. Grid layout is like a grid, and it arranges the components into rows and columns.